Okay, successfully, finally, I was able to tra transmit sound from my computer to the to the phone using the RF uh, mod. I mean, in the RF range by using nothing more than a headphone jack. So setup is like this: I have the headphone jack, and I've just connected to an LM324 to amplify the signal. I'm using the part. I'm using the Arduino. Is Arduino as a part source here, plus five volts. And then from the LM324's output, I've just given it to a 32 megahertz crystal oscillator. Now you think that I would have attached an antenna, but um, it works without attaching any sort of antenna. But I'm theorizing that since I've used a lot of long wires and uh, that is somehow acting as the antenna. So, I'll sh okay, there's something you... Well, something weird that happened uh, but before that I'll show you what happens when I've just connected to the plus 5 volts from the Arduino and negative 5 volts from the Arduino to the LM324. In this setup I've just uh, tuned my phone to 96 megahertz and I've connected to a speaker over here so that uh, you'll be able to hear it um, yeah, you know, loud and clear because last time I found that you're not able to I was not able to record properly so so I I'm playing a song over here on my computer and uh, but as you can see it's like very grainy and uh, I mean it is getting transmitted but then it's very noisy but here is a trick okay thing is you go and remove this negative terminal from the thing from the LM324 and all of a sudden it becomes really clear see I'll show you this this is from the ground of the Arduino and you just put it here you can hear how noisy it has become and uh, I remove this so this is 96 megahertz again because 32 megahertz crystal here and um, Yeah, and one more thing is that if I bring my hand closer to one of these, the wire that is transmitting from the headphone jack, I leave my hand. I'm not sure whether it's uh, you're able to audibly hear the increase in amplitude of the sound that is trans that you're able to hear on the speaker, but then um, uh, when you try it out, it's like very the, there's a substantial increase in the amplitude of when I keep my hand on the left of the headphone jack. So uh, that's about it. So uh, the mechanism overall is like here's the transmission side of the. Um, uh, transmission side and this is the receiver side I, as you can see there's nothing in between that is just happening it's just a it's just air and um, that's about it and yeah if you ask for the range the range is um, I, I would say um, uh, it's um, okay I don't have quantitative thing for the range but I guess it's Pretty. If I if I keep my hand, it does increase a bit, and uh, um, as far as now is concerned, I, I don't have a um, particular value for the range. But I'm still testing it out, and this one seemed like a very good, pretty cool method. You know, like if sinusoids, choir waves. We tried choir waves in the last videos, and now with songs or anything like you can just transmit with just a headphone jack and an LM324 and a 32 megahertz crystal us later I thought I think that is amazing I mean that's an amazing improvement over the present technology so bye